I found this old guitar on a wardrobe in the shed Dad said it was me uncle's and it'd been around a bit I said, what's the story? Where'd you get these autographs? A sparkle came into his eyes as he talked about the past. They called them traveling country shows. They toured across the land. They played in tents and country halls, lived out of caravans. We always went to see them. To us, they were all stars. We'd always buy their records and they'd sign this old guitar. Had Buddy Williams on the pickguard and Slim above the strings. Barry Thornton and Stan Costa next to Joy and Heather McKean. Brian Young had signed the fretboard, Tex Morton scratched his D. And next to Smokey Dawson was a sheik of scrubby green. Terry Gordon and Reg Lindsay, Gordon Parsons, Rick and Thel. Shorty Ranger's name had faded, some are good and read as well. As Dad reminisced about those golden days and all the country dances that they travelled to and played, he said we thought we were stars when we'd play and sing. So one night we stuck our autographs right next door to Slim's. Had Buddy Williams on the pickguard and Slim above the strings. Barry Thornton and Stan Costa next to Joy and Heather McKean. Brian Young had signed the fretboard. Tex Morton scratched his D. And next to Smokey Dawson was the sheep of Scrubby Creek. Shorty Ranger's name had faded, some couldn't read as well. And all these famous autographs fill up every space. Pioneers of country music, still household names today. There's two that sort of don't belong, yet somehow kind of fit. It's me dad's and me uncle's, right next door to Slim's. Yeah, me dad's and me uncle's, right next to the king. Thank you very, very much for listening, and please thank these blokes. It's so cool to hear your music played by other people, and they could sort of follow me. Happy days, enjoy your day.